piece of silly kitty. He became my cat because he was at my daughter's friend's house, belonged to some other lady, but went to stay at her house. And the girl, well, smoky cat, jumped in my truck. And he wrapped his legs and paws around me, and he wouldn't leave. He's very persistent. You know, he's a male. And so anyway, he, don't you bite me now. So anyway, he uh, jumped in the truck, wouldn't leave, so I finally got him out. And he jumped back in and just wrapped his paws around my leg and was rubbing all over me. And the girl said, so do you want to take the cat home? And I'm like, well, I have two dogs. I really didn't want a cat. But anyway, he... He was just so persistent that I had to take him home. And he's still the same way, persistent. And he's very, uh, kind of controlling. Like he, like he lays on you and he won't get off. But then when he gets tired of you messing with him or petting him, then he'll try and bite you. Now let's see what he's going to do because I quit petting him. Oh, uh, he's going to go over there and I can't. He's going to go over there and lick himself. Let's see what he does. What are you going to do, Smokey? Hmm? What are you going to do, Smokey? Go to sleep? And he's just a really smart cat, y'all. He really is. You know what he's trying to do now? Is climb up on me. Mm-hmm. <laughs> He's got his paws in me. He's like, why ain't you petting me? Oh, yeah, see his ears laid back? He lays his ears back when he gets mad. And he knows when you're talking about him, too. See him? He'll put his ears back when you're talking about him. Yes, yeah, Smokey Kitty, I'm talking about you. I, I, yeah. I'm talking about you, Smokey Kitty. You gonna be nice to Mommy? You gonna be nice? Hmm? So, I've had the cat probably about six, maybe seven years. I don't know. It's been a good while. And when I moved out of the house and into a camper, and then my daughter had a camper, he would go back and forth between both of our campers. That's how smart this cat is. And now there's three of them, and he'll go back and forth between all three. So he's got three homes. He'll eat, sleep, get petted, <laughs> go outside. Yeah. So he's one lucky kitty cat. He's got three houses. Yeah. And he was getting in fights in the old neighborhood. His one eye, I don't know if he can see out of it or not. Because it was kind of flawed. Something got his eye. Tore his ear up. He's still got a bald spot there. My neighbor said he was a mean cat because he was going after his dog. Said he heard his dog screaming. But his dog also has a bad habit of chasing cats. So that's the story behind Smokey. And that's how he became my cat. And like I said, he's extremely smart. <laughs> Ain't you smoky? Ain't you a smart cat? Ain't you a smart kitty?
tell me. Say, I'm a smart cat. Say, I know what I want and I get it. Say, I know what I want and I always get it. You know, say, I always get what I want. <laughs> yeah, well, I guess she's wanting to go to sleep now. <laughs> Okay, we'll let you sleep. Oh, only if I'm petting him, I guess. Smokey, why you got your paws? You're just all spread out. But anyway, yeah, he's a sweet kitty cat. Mostly when he's sleeping. <laughs> but yeah, he's, oh, by the way, he's on flea pills. He wouldn't be in my bed if he wasn't. <laughs> oh, well, you put your back? Because you're like, yes, I would be in your bed. <laughs> I'm here to tell you, you wouldn't be. Yep. All right, Smokey. Mucky Kitty, quit licking yourself and tell the people bye. Oh, well. He's got a mind of his own. Alright. Me and Smokey will see you later. So he decided to get off me. Oh, by the way, Jen. Looky there. Got my socks on, too. <laughs> And now he's over there laying down like he wants to go out. Again. Alright, bye y'all.